Need some coins for that God Squad you've always wanted? For fast and the cheapest coins anywhere, make sure you guys check out MMOEXP.com and use code ZERK for 5% off your order. Link is in the description. The whole thing wobbing. Run guys, it's Zerk's match today with another Madden Ultimate Team video. And today I'm gonna be going over the Harvest All Stars because they've actually updated now in overall. I kind of forgot that was even gonna be today because it wasn't at 10:30. It was later on. As of right now, it's about 12:30, and they did update. And also, there's a little teaser for Barry Sanders. We're gonna get into that. I do want to give a shout out to Dustin for being a part of the Nota Gang. If you guys have a chance to shout out the next video, drop a like in the vid. Make sure you guys are sub the channel to Nafish Milan and come down below Nota Gang. And also, if you guys want to enter for the Zerk Miss giveaways, I am giving away three Xbox Series S's and a PlayStation 5. All you guys gotta do, drop a like in the vid, make sure you sub the channel. Comment down below the secret word on this video and every video this month because on December 31st, I'm gonna go through and select four random videos and select four random winners off those videos. So for today, comment down below, Dak, Dak, and leave a way to contact you. Uh, I prefer Twitter or Instagram, but email also works. Also, I am running a two $50 gift card giveaway over on Twitter, so that link will also be at the top of the comment section and over on Twitter. It is NBA Pick'em uh, today with Underdog Fantasy, so if you guys want to go ahead and check that out, you can use code Zerk Underdog Fantasy, match your first deposit up to $100, and I'm also running some private drafts for the NFL game, so me versus nine of you guys, so make sure you guys are signed up. Follow me on Twitter, turn the noting bell on so you guys can be notified when I'm doing more drafts. As of the time I'm actually recording this video, I've already done one, and by the time this video goes up, I've probably already done another one, and I'm probably going to have like one or two more today, and I'll run some more tomorrow before Sunday's games, but NBA Pick'em Slates, I'll have those out later tonight. Check it out. All right, so let's go over these Harvest Day players and the upgrades that they did get. And then I'll show you guys the Barry Sanders news that we have in the game. Pretty exciting stuff. Definitely pretty exciting stuff. So starting off with Dak Prescott, you guys can see he did not pass for 400 plus yards. But he did score a TD, and he was actually really close, 400 plus yards. So he now has got 84 speed, 92 throw power, 91 short, 88 medium, 91 deep. Uh, not much of, you know, a crazy upgrade here. He only got plus one, I'm pretty sure, to everything there. So Dak, it is, uh, it, it is what it is with him. But let's go ahead and take a look here at these other guys. Now, I want to say, right, I think somebody did do both of their things. I think it was Renfro. I think it was Renfro who actually did get updated to a 93. And it looks like he might not be up right now. But Tremaine Edmonds, he did also do one thing. So Bill's forced to turn over. He did not get six solo tackles. But he is up to 90 speed now. 91 Excel, 83 strength, 89 tackling, 91 play rank, 89 block. She had 90 hit power. Still terrible zone coverage. But now his speed's up even higher. 84 change of direction. Uh, and he's also got 86 jumping. So that is Tremaine Edmonds. And that is Dak are these other two up and there he is hunter renfro right there for some reason he didn't pop up first but he actually did both things the thing is though the card is still bad he's got 92 speed they actually kind of juice the speed up a little bit i'm pretty sure he had 89 speed maybe a 90 speed base but he's up to 92 speed 95 acceleration 94 catching 87 catch and traffic 88 spec catch 92 short 90 medium 87 deep Still not the craziest about the card. Definitely not the craziest about the card. Uh, 93 change of direction. Only 86 juke moves. 77 break tackle. Run blocking is 50 and 57. And it is what it is. I'm not crazy about it. Here we have TJ Hawkinson who did not catch five passes, but he did catch a TD. He's got 88 speed, 91 acceleration, 86 short, 83 medium, 81 run blocking, 88 catch of traffic, and 91 spec catch. Now, before, right, these players upgrade anything, kind of like when the promo first dropped, Hawkinson would have been so good at a 93 overall. But even now with him being up to a 93, if he you know was to get the uh, five catches there, he still wouldn't be like top tier tight ends because he's just gotten so many better tight ends. But he's got good run blocking on him. Not great after the catch, but solid speed, good run block. Also, just so you guys can uh, see this as well, right? They're pretty cheap. They are pretty cheap right now. You know, 88K, 90K. Was it worth the investment? Probably not for these players. Uh, who is the other? I know there's two more players I'm missing here, and I'm trying to remember off the top of my head who exactly they were. And one of those guys was Eddie Jackson, who didn't do anything. So he didn't get upgraded at all. Did nothing. And here is Malcolm Jenkins. That was the final player I couldn't think of, but he actually did get an interception, and they didn't allow more than 425 yards. So he's up to a 93. 
Card's still kind of bad. 91 speed, 94 excel, 93 play rec, 92 pursuit, 77 man, 87 zone, 86 hit power. Uh, he's got, you know, 93 jumping, 6 feet tall, 90 change direction, 80 block shed, but the zone, the hit power isn't really there. Not a big fan of the card still. As for the Harvest All-Stars, if you guys did go ahead and make an investment of them, you probably didn't end up making coins, but now you can add them to power-ups if you guys want to. So if there's anybody you want to pick up, Dak, Hawkinson, whoever, you can pick them up, power them up. There you go. Now, as for the Barry Sanders news, if you guys come out to the main menu here, you go to limited time deals when we come into the yard. Well, for those of you guys that kind of pay attention here with the yard, right? Pretty much every single time that there is any sort of player in the yard here in the store, they get a card very, very shortly in Ultimate Team. And you guys can see right here, we have Barry Sanders and Jerry Rice. So Barry and Jerry Rice looks like they're going to be potentially coming to Mutt really, really soon. Now, of course, how do you know they're going to be coming to Mutt? Well, because, like I said, literally every single time we get a player in here, they come to Mutt really shortly after. Bo knows at the objective list. Uh, we've had some other player ones. I don't think they're going to show here, unfortunately. Uh, but we've had some other player ones, like Lawrence Taylor. He immediately came into the game. There's been a lot of players that we've seen in here, and then, boom, they come to Mutt. So, Barry, Jerry Rice, could they be legends this weekend? I kind of doubt it. I kind of doubt it because we already have so many good wide receivers in the game. And also, Barry just want to make sense right now, right? I mean, we just got Bo Jackson. We just got Bo. We just got uh, Roger Craig, LeGarrette Blunt. There's so many running backs that we just recently got in the game. I don't think they're going to drop Barry this weekend. However, I do think he's going to be in zero chill. I think it makes perfect sense. Could he be like a Bo Nose legend? Same thing with Jerry Rice maybe they could be bow nose guys but i, I kind of doubt that i really feel like if they're teasing them in here they are going to be uh, more so with the zero chill promo which we already know is confirmed to be coming out at least we expect it anyways next week because it's confirmed that we have news of the promo on thursday they're gonna be dropping news of the promo on thursday which to me pretty much means it's dropping on friday right if they're going over the promo on thursday it's gonna be coming out on friday so barry maybe he's a zero chill master Maybe he's a zero chill master, maybe like a ghost Madden master. Or do you guys think he's just in the bow nose promo? You let me know down below what you think about it. Also, I do know there was something about Peyton Manning with him becoming, uh, you know, a ratings adjuster for Madden. He also could be coming to Mutt very soon. So with that being said, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. And if you did, make sure you guys drop a like on it. And of course, hit that sub button down below. Let me know what you guys think. Legends, bow nose legends for Mondays. Uh, is he going to be in the zero chill? What do you guys think? Hope you guys enjoyed. See you guys next time.